And we're so honored to be gathered here in the beautiful Nathan Phillips Square to celebrate Mabuhai Festival. I'm joined with my honorable colleagues from across all different levels of government to really thank PIDC for 26 years of putting us together every single year to celebrate our incredible Filipino culture, heritage, and tradition. Now, in the word Mabuhai, for those of that you don't know, is buhai, which means life. And I just want to take, I would be remiss if I did not mention someone's life. His name is Avi Rakra. He uh, was my campaign manager. We lost him a few days ago. But the reason why I talk about his life is that I would not be able to have the honor to stand in front of all of you today had it not been for him. So today, as he leaves us, I want to make sure that we honor him today his life, his legacy, to celebrate this incredible festival in Toronto. Now I want to share something amazing about my colleague here, Rob Oliphant. With Rob's help, with our Indo-Pacific strategy that we launched in 2022, we have continued to build strong people-to-people -people ties between the Philippines, and we've had 10 ministers since 2015 go back and forth and travel to continue to strengthen those ties. As a result, we've been able to have visa-free travel between here and the Philippines. That means visa-free travel back and forth to see your families and to be there. Second, we've also enabled through Minister Miller our caregivers who come here to this incredible country will now become permanent residencies and will have our language requirements lowered for them. And in addition to that, we also opened an Indo-Pacific agriculture office in Manila and we continue to open our office there to strengthen the relations and all those amazing things. Because here in Canada, we have one million Filipinos strong and this year we celebrate 75 years of Canada-Philippine relations. Now, one little story I want to share about PIDC is um, in 2018, a small business entrepreneur called them, that was me, and I said, can you give me a chance? And so I was one of those vendors in 2018 and 19 selling my Filipino desserts. So I ask you while you're here today, please visit our small business entrepreneurs, just as Rob said, because they are the heart of our communities and they are all part of this. So enjoy the festival today, enjoy your time, and maraming maraming salamat po for all the Filipinos and all you do for this amazing country. Mabuhay Toronto! Thank you very much, Member of Parliament and uh, Minister of Small Business, Reggie Valdez, as well as Member of Parliament.